Hello everybody! This video will show you how to learn logins and passwords of another user or someone's sign-up information for social media accounts – Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Vkontakte, Odnoklasniki – or search engine accounts, online stores, dating websites and other data used to sign in various websites. For convenience, all modern browsers suggest remembering passwords to user accounts in Facebook, Vkontakte, Odnoklasniki, Instagram, email services, etc. As a result, users can sign in to their accounts without having to enter the password and login every time. All this information is safely protected and stored inside the browser. It is usually located in Manage Passwords menu, like in Google Chrome or in privacy and security passwords like in Opera or in privacy and security forms and passwords like in Mozilla Firefox. However, another user cannot just open the menu and see the settings. To do it, you will need a password to such computer or a master password that has been set up before. It seems completely logical, and the user data should be safely protected, but this is where you go wrong. Hetman Internet Spy opens the passwords saved in the browser, addresses entered when filling in online forms, downloads history and bookmarks created by the user. The sign-in data together with the browsing history will provide you with a way to access any personal information on the people you are interested in. How does it work? For example, there is a computer or an account on a computer which was used by the person you are interested in. You need to learn the login and password of the user's account at a certain web resource or all web resources. To view this data, run Hetman Internet Spy. You will find the link to the official web page of the program in the description below this video. The interface is very simple and doesn't require having any special skills. In the welcome screen, start the analysis and wait until the program finds all users of this system. After the comprehensive disk scan, you will see the list of Windows user accounts. In the next window, the program will suggest you to select a user account for analysis. Click on the one you are interested in. Please note that you can analyze any user account on this computer, and it doesn't matter which user account is active at the moment. There is no need to enter any passwords either. Now you can see all browsers installed on this computer. Here is a special point. You will be shown even the browsers which used to exist in this user account years ago, but were uninstalled later for some reason. And the most amazing thing is that Hetman Internet Spy can analyze such uninstalled browsers as well. Click to select a browser for analysis. Today's browsers save everything you do online. Web page URLs, data visit, time spent on a web page, logins and passwords used, downloaded files, and lots of other information will be at your disposal after the analysis. Later, you can change your choice of data to check other accounts and browsers. After the program finishes analyzing data for the selected browser, it will show it sorted by tabs. All data required to log on to websites and saved in the browser is shown in the Passwords tab. This is where you can find everything about logins and passwords of the user account you have analyzed. All the information is grouped into four columns. They are the website where the user assign in their account, the login and password, the column showing how often this login and password are used. If there is too much information, you can sort it in one of the following ways. Suit websites in the alphabetical order by clicking on the website column. In the same way, you can sort the information by username or password if you are looking for something specific. Clicking on Times Used will sort the usernames and passwords by frequency of usage. You can also add a filter to every column or add one of the additional settings. For example, user name element, password element, URL address, creation or synchronization date. If you click on a certain item, you will see more detailed information about it in the Properties panel, including its date of creation. Double-click on a website to visit it. It will open in your default browser. Then. Enter the login and password detected by Hetman Internet Spy. 
Using the login keys, you can view someone's emails and social media messages sent to other people. Entering a person's accounts in Google and Facebook gives access to complete browsing history and search queries, all the movements via geolocation, all the person's contacts, and lots of other private information. After viewing the analysis result in the program window, you can save a report for later use or import into another system. To generate it, run the Export Wizard by clicking on the Export button in the main menu. Specify what section you want to ex export. By default, the program suggests exporting all the information, but you can also select to export only information from the currently opened section. Click Next to continue. Choose the path to save the report and select the format – Excel, HTML or PDF – and click Next. This is how an exported report looks like. If you need to analyze another browser of this user, go to the main menu and click the icon of the browser which you are analyzing now and select Change Browser. Then select another browser available. To analyze data for another user of this computer, click on the current user icon and select Change User. Follow the previous steps again to analyze the account. You can watch another video to see how to use Hetman Internet Spy to view and restore removed browsing history, analyze search queries, and online communications of a user. Find the link in the description below this video. That is all for now. Subscribe to the official YouTube channel of Hetman Software. Hit the like button below. Ask questions in your comments. Thank you for watching and good luck.